Hi, everyone. If we haven't met, I'm Ellen from Ellen's Tips for iOS. In my last video, I showed you how to save phone numbers and share contacts on your iPhone. Today, we're going to fix what often happens after that. Duplicate contacts, missing names, and confusing contact photos. If your contacts list feels messy or overwhelming, this video is for you. Contacts don't get messy because you're doing something wrong. It usually happens because you save the same person more than once. Someone shares their contact info with you. You add a phone number from an email or iCloud syncs contacts from more than one account. The good news, your iPhone now has the tools that make cleanup much easier. Let's start with duplicates. The first thing you'll need to do is open the contacts app. So I'm in the app library area. I'll tap where it says app library and I'll search for contacts. Once I locate contacts, I'll click on it to open. And what you'll want to do is scroll to the top of your contact list. Look for duplicates found. If your iPhone sees duplicates, you'll see a message that says the number and how many duplicates were found. At this point, we're going to go ahead and tap on View Duplicates. Once I do them, you'll see all of my duplicates that appear, and I can review them one by one, or I can tap Merge All if I'm comfortable with that. So if you're comfortable, when you see the duplicates that appear, go ahead and tap on Merge All. If not, go into a duplicate. I'll go ahead and do that. Once I do, I can say go ahead and merge that duplicate. Your iPhone will combine phone numbers, emails, and information so nothing important is lost. You'll confirm it. I'll say merge. And now that particular contact has been merged with the information that is already on my phone. This is safe to do, and it's one of the easiest ways to clean up your contacts. Another common issue I hear about is the same photo showing up for two different people. Here's how to fix that. Locate the contact that you want to change. So in this case, I'm just going to open the Apple contact. Once you do, you want to tap edit in the upper right corner and then tap edit or the photo that's located there. Once you do that, now you have the option to choose a new photo. Each contact has its own photo, so once you fix it here, the confusion should go away. Now let's make sure your contacts stay clean going forward. We're going to want to open the Settings app, tap your name at the top, now tap on iCloud, and we're going to want to tap on See All next to Save to iCloud. Now we're going to want to locate Contacts and make sure that that toggle next to Contacts has been uh, turned on. This ensures that your contacts stay consistent across your iPhone, iPad, and Mac. Here's an extra tip for seniors. If your contacts are turned on in multiple accounts, and you may want to do that, but if I have contacts turned on in Gmail and iCloud, this can also cause duplicates. Let me show you where you can find this info. So if I tap on the Settings app and I scroll to the very bottom, but make sure that you're on the main Settings page, if I scroll to the very bottom and I tap on Apps, now I'm going to tap on the C on the right-hand side so I can quickly get to the Contacts app. Once I locate Contacts, I'll tap on it to open. And you'll see here Contacts Accounts. Tap on that. And if you have more than one account, check each one. As you can see, I have iCloud Contacts turned on. 
but I have my Gmail contacts. I have mail turned on, but the contacts are stored uh, in the cloud at Gmail, and I have those turned off. Here are a few easy habits that help keep contacts tidy. When you're adding a new contact number, try adding it to an existing account if possible so that you don't have duplicates. Let your iPhone merge duplicates instead of deleting manually. Review contacts every once in a while, even five minutes helps. Use iCloud so everything stays backed up and synced. Think of it like cleaning out a drawer. A little at a time is perfect. Here's a quick recap. Merge duplicate contacts. Fix incorrect contact photos. Check iCloud syncing and keep things simple going forward. Once your contacts are clean, saving and sharing them becomes much easier. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And if you missed my previous video on saving and sharing contacts, I'll link it right in the video description below. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.